What's up everyone? In this video, I will show you how to change the internal battery in this Acura ZDX key fob. Um, if yours has four buttons or three buttons, doesn't matter as long as it's the flipping, uh, the one with the flipping internal key for the ZDX, it's the same exact process. Really easy to do. All you will need is one of these CR1616 batteries. And if you want to get one on Amazon, I've left a link down in the description. It's just a couple bucks. Come right to your door. And the only other thing you will need is a precision screwdriver or some kind of screwdriver small enough for you to remove this screw. I'm going to be using a 1.4 millimeter precision screwdriver. If you don't have something like this, you can get one of these on Amazon for just a couple bucks. And again, I'll put the link in the description because you will need one of these and they come in handy around the house. So once you have everything you need, start by coming to the bottom of this key fob and removing that screw. Just twist it out, be really careful not to drop it. Set it aside. Now we'll be able to lift up this face of the key fob. You can just push on here and this will kind of hang off like that and you can just pull it, kind of pull it up like this and out like this. You'll hear that little click. That's not something breaking. That's just a mechanism. Comes right off and now you can set this to the side. You see this part, push on the, ba uh, the buttons. If you push, this will come out and this is what we're gonna work with. On the right side, there is a little indentation. I'm gonna put my tool in there and just twist to open it up. Same tool, any flathead screwdriver really would work. You just twist just until it starts to come apart and then you can open it with your fingers. Voila. Here is our battery and all we're going to do is come in from the corner and just kind of pry it out. Super easy. See it just comes popping right out. Be gentle. Here's the CR1616 and when you have a new one Make sure the positive side with this text and the battery information goes down, just like this. Position it and just click it into place and now reattach everything. We are done. Just gonna click everything back together. Make sure it's all secure and lined up. You can test, see that light will come on if your battery is has some juice. Just Put everything back the way you found it. Now this part, we're just going to kind of add an angle like this, push it into place, click it down, and that's it. Just put this screw back in, give it a twist, that's all it takes. If this video helped you out, feel free to leave a like or a comment, and to see the full guide on how to change the battery for this key fob, or to see information on any Acura key fob, click the link in the description to go to fobbattery.com. Thank you so much for watching.